stop the van. No. Please. You've got to do this. But I feel sick. Yeah, you'll be fine. No, I won't. I'll lose her. I'll lose everything. No, you won't. But if she knows what I know, if she knows what I've done. Right, the secrets and lies stop now. Please, stop the van. Right, first we told Leanne, then Mum, then Kylie. What, and who put you in charge? Be OK. We'll do it together. I'm on your side. But I don't want you on my side. I could still have a future. It'll be fine. No, he won't. Stop the van. What are you doing? Stop the van. Get off. Stop it. Stop the van. Stop the van. Stop it. Stop the van. King Wenceslas like his pizza. Oh, stop it! Is that, listen, <laughs> deep pan crisp. Stop it! <gasps> oh, yesterday, I couldn't remember Bethany's name. I'm ill, David. I'm ill. You know, I'm really glad that Lily's yours, but if you could stop dancing on the ceiling, I'd be really, really grateful. Nick, we wouldn't even be in this situation now if you hadn't have done what you did. All right, the, the last two days, the last few months, I've been in agony. I've had no sleep. I've been lying and making up excuses, and, and then you go and put me through this. Keep your voice down. No, I could have opened this letter, Nick, today to find out the one person I love the most in this world is, is not even mine, that it's yours. I mean, do you blame me for smiling? You tried to kill me. No, no, I tried to stop the van so that you wouldn't tell everybody the truth. You wanted my belt. You terrorised me for weeks of my family, my business. No, Nick, you weren't innocent. Why didn't you just confront us? You know why? For the sake of my marriage, for the sake of your marriage, and for the sake of Lily. <laughs> You're sick. You're sick. There's just something in your brain that's just... Something in my brain? What? There's something in your brain that insisted on this twisted revenge. I should have known it was you. I should have known... No, you will get better, Nick, all right? You will. I will always know that you had my wife and that, what you two did, that was sick. You should be locked up. You know, I should be dead and you should be locked up. You got it all, haven't you? But what about me? What about my business? Right, it's my always family, about you. It's my always about you. Everything's always about you, Nick. This whole family revolves around you. I mean, what, what makes you think you can sleep with my wife and get away with it? But you think I've got away with it? Yeah. Yeah. Look at me. Look at me. We were drunk. How do you think these things happen? And she was up for it. Don't like her. Listen to me. I hope you never get well. All right? I, I hope you never get well. I hope you can't tie your own shoelaces or even count to ten or eat a bowl of cornflakes without any help. And every time that happens, I want you to remember Christmas night and me and remember that you lost Nick because Lily's mine, you've got brain damage, and I, for once, Nick, I came out on top. Hold on. If it weren't for that letter, I wouldn't have shown my face in the first place. But you still... You still chose to come back. To apologise! I don't want you to see her again. No phone calls, no love letters, no anything. And no job. Definitely no job. And I suppose I don't have a say in this. Oh, no, no, you get a say. You get a say. You get to say goodbye. I don't enjoy being threatened. OK. Think of it as a request. Inside, I knew a few hard cases. Left you cold, standing in their shadows. This isn't you, son. Yeah. A year ago, I would have agreed with you. A year ago, I had a future. I had a wife. I had an undamaged brain. And zero anger management issues. Now, granted. You've probably got more experience with the legal system than I have. But if I chose to lose it with the man who's been terrorising my mother, I'm sure my condition would be considered a mitigating factor. So, in other words, get lost or get a hiding. Well, I'm glad we're all on the same page. John, let's go. Good chap.
hope things work out for you. What? Are you staring at me like that for, Nick? That hurts, what? Shut up. I know. I got what I want. However, you, my friend, you've lost everything. Nick, just for the record, she only asked you because she can't have me. Says the man she married, because she thought you were dying. She will always want me. Funny, because half the time she was with you, she was sleeping with me. Have you got any idea what you look like? You're scrabbling around in the dirt for my leftovers, Nick. Everybody's having a good laugh at you. She's dumped you before, and she will go on dumping you as long as I'm around. Who's scrabbling on the floor now? Sling your smarmy hole. Get in there! Did I ask you? No. No, no, I didn't. You're just here to make yourself feel better, not me. Now, that's not true. Oh, come on, Nick. There's no need to be so rude to your mum. I don't even know why you're here. Why can't you just leave me alone? It's just women just round me talking rubbish. Just go away. Go home. We want to help. OK, you want to help me? You want to help me? You tell David I want to see him and I want to see him now. David's deadly serious about this christening, though. He's really getting into it. Nick, did, did you... Gina, you just squeezed me and... Oh, come on, Nick, do it again for me, please. Come on. Wasn't it just a spasm? No, no, it wasn't. It, it was definitely a squeeze, like he was listening. You were listening, weren't you? Just leave it, Nick. You knew what she did, and you're sticking by it. Oi, Nick, I haven't done out. She did. You say that one more time, I'm gonna knock you out. She's lying! How long have you known she was involved in the fire? I'm going to take her home and I'll be back for work. Okay. No, 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 no! When we were in the beast show and you knew I was worried about Carly, you were going to tell me something. This whole thing is... You Nick. knew! Nick! Did you see that? I'll give you that one. We could do you for assault. I didn't see anything. You tripped and fell. Just watch where you're going, mate. By the way, you're fired. Are you going to let him get away with that? We're going. You think that was helping? He lied. This is not your fight. It's mine. Uh, I'll take it off your tab. But you had my tab what? Oh, come on. You didn't think all that booze you've been shoving down your neck was you free, did you? You miserable tightwad. Cough up. Now, no. come on, where's your wallet? Get off. Where is it? <laughs> You'll never Not until find you it, give me it? that money. Ha <laughs> 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 Sorry. Um, it's okay. It's the drink. It's, uh, it's a drink. So I think I should go because Roy will probably be wondering where I am and, uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. See ya. What if you think your brain problems come back? Keep your voice down. You think that? I don't think that. Stop trying to confuse me. You're in denial, I know you. <laughs> 
I'm not. Honestly. Look at the wedding. Selling this place, moving on. It's up there with bereavement, isn't it, in terms of stress? All right, well, maybe if you just, you know, go see the doctor, see what he says. <laughs> what is he wearing? <laughs> is that below? It's casual wear, why? Well, we were just asking Bethany if she wanted to come swimming with us. Do you want to go? No, let, let's just go inside. She can bring her ugly baby too if she wants. What did you say? It's not yours, is it? You know, I think you should go. Oh, he thinks we should go. And leave my niece alone. Free country, sorry. <laughs> he looks angry. Are you angry? You look like you're about to have a fit. <laughs> I I said, me. Leave my niece alone! I can get you in for an MRI in the next few days. What would that say? It's what you're paying for. And the sooner we take a look, the better. But this scan is just precautionary, right? We need to see what's going on, Mr Tilsley. Until we know what we're dealing with, I can't really venture a diagnosis. Yeah, and I can't have any peace of mind. I need to know what's wrong. It'll definitely be this week. Well, why don't you just do it now, you know? I'm here, the machine is, for what I remember, it's 30 minutes tops. Look, I understand your frustration. No, 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 no you don't! It's daft, sorry. <laughs> that was my designer mug. Yeah, I am a bad man. It's a flop. Oh, God. It's your cheek. Hey. Oh, no. I'm sorry. I, I'm, it's okay. I'm so sorry. It's not. It's okay. It's not okay. It's not okay. Nick, it was an accident. It's okay. Yeah. Come on. They have declared their marriage by the joining of hands and by the giving and receiving of a ring. I therefore proclaim that they are husband and wife. <laughs>